Hello job seekers, welcome to Brainy Bites Academy. Today again I just came with one of the quick update uh, from EPAM. Till yesterday and till today even uh, afternoon also like uh, registrations are open and a lot of people got applied for EPAM right. So now uh, those who got shortlisted in the like those resumes are got shortlisted for them um, test results like uh, got the assessment link for the test and the test will be connected by tomorrow between 10 to 10, to 10 20 a.m. tomorrow. And once got shortlisted uh, after test, then uh, the, the, those candidates will be calling into the next uh, in-person interview to the regular like respective offices. Let's just dive into the EPAM like what details like what, for what role that it is asking and uh, then we'll go into the like uh, uh, what type of test that they are conducting and how many questions that they are asking and what type of questions that they are going to ask. All those things we'll discuss later. Just like uh, briefly like uh, EPAM is hiring for a junior software engineer trainee role. And uh, as I already mentioned, like in my previous video, like uh, it, it is it is into the automation QA position. So you need to be know about uh, Selenium test NGJ unit, Cypress and Blaverite tools, as they already mentioned in that. So it is a typical kind of automation QA engineer role. And then you need to know about uh, test writing of test scripts using all the Selenium test engine, Cypress Blaverite tool, and you need to develop uh, like what are the test cases those got written and for them you need to automate as a part of this role. And coming into the compensation, like uh, they already provided, like uh, uh, at the time of training period, they are providing 27,500 as a stipend. Post of that, then you will get 8 lakhs package, which is very, which which is very good actually. And all these are eligibility criteria. So just le let's move into like one of our uh, follower got shortlisted for the next round and he got the assessment details. So he got the mail like uh, this actually from basically this test is like a do select test. Invitation to EPM Fresher test S25, 8th November 25. Like this test will be connected by tomorrow. This is a fail mail came from EPM. If you see here, this type of mail came to one of our follower. And then like this, uh, this is like test details under like uh, this is the uh, assessment link that uh, he got. And uh, if you see here, number of problems that they are going to ask is like a 27. And mostly there will be like uh, 25 to 26 questions like multiple choice questions and there will be one coding questions into it and uh, the multiple choice questions like uh, it's a combination of aptitude reasoning and then English uh, and then a uh, few typical uh, Java questions like uh, based on multiple multiple choice questions all these combinations they will ask and there will be one coding test one coding questions will be there, there actually and this is about like uh, all coding details and the another mail the got like another mail that they, they got mail is like uh, they are all greetings from EPAM. We are pleased to inform you that you have been shortlisted for the next round of our recruitment process as a part of next step required to take online test schedule for Saturday 8th November 10 a.m. to 10 20 a.m. actually. So as an in-person interview will be held to the all test shortlisted candidates most likely in the next week interview location and date will be shared shortly accordingly. So once you got shortlisted in the test, then you will get the in-person interview mails. This is what they're going to like. They just uh, trying to communicate through this mail. Like uh, same one of our follower got these details and all. So there will be like uh, 27 multiple choice questions into that 20, 25 to 26 will be the multiple choice and one will be the coding test or one or two will be the coding test. And all are like into aptitude, reasoning, and then combination of English and all they will ask. So just dive into some do select uh, concepts. If you see here, like uh, it depends on the companies and all, like uh, there will be, it will change. So. You, before going to test, you just uh, if you have time under like uh, try to attend some sample test over here so that you will get some knowledge like how test questions are getting asked and all. Just take one sample test. It, it is just like 15 minutes. Like you will get to know like basic uh, questions and all and uh, what they are trying to ask all these questions that you will get to know. This is about a uh, test actually guys. 
so be prepared for the test tomorrow and all the best for all the people who are going to write the test and those who got test mails all the best for all those people and this is the mail that uh, got from one of our follower even all the best for him as well thank you all i'll come up with one another new video thank you